I'm very excited for this role. With it being the first time that I'm full-time captain, a lot of prep has gone into um, sort of understanding my bowlers, what their plans are, understanding their fields, um, bowling changes. So I've spent a lot of time speaking with the bowlers and the coaches. Um, and yeah, with it being the first time coming to Pakistan, just trying to get a lot of info on the conditions, on what we can expect. I think it's, it's been quite a long journey, even though I'm, I made my debut for South Africa at 16, so I've been in the side for quite a while. Um, I think it's always been in the back of my mind that I would like to leave the side one day, but I didn't know when the time would be right or when the opportunity would present itself. So it was a bit of a surprise when the role became available now, but yeah, I'm, I'm welcoming it with open arms and, and hopefully it goes okay. My mom comes from Belgium, so she didn't even know what cricket was. Um, but they were always pretty supportive. Um, from a very young age, I was quite adamant that I wanted to play cricket and they never stopped me or never encouraged that I'd play anything else. They let me play in all the boys' teams, uh, very encouraging of me doing it. I don't think they realized it would become sort of my career and my job one day. Yeah, in all those years, I just never stopped loving the game and just kept playing and, and made it all the way through the journey. And yeah, now I'm here today. I found that the people here are very friendly, um, the hospitality has been great. I felt the same way even when I was here as part of the league and not as part of the South African team. So I wish I could see a bit more of Pakistan, maybe in the future we'd be able to, um, but everyone has been very, very friendly. In the last five to ten years have been incredible for women's cricket. Um, I think there's been so many major changes with the leagues coming up, um, IPL auction, Pakistan leagues, Big Bash 100, um, with a lot of countries promoting equal match fees now for a lot of the games as well. There's been major, major strides recently. We also recently have equal match fees and are starting a, a domestic tour back at home, um, which I think will help us a lot with the pipeline and for getting younger girls in cricket and staying in cricket. I would love for us to have a league as well, uh, maybe a women's version of the SA20. That would be awesome just because the SA20 was such a success for the men in South Africa. So if we could play a couple of games um, in and around that time, I think that would be a great idea. Um, but yeah, I think we're definitely heading in the right direction and, and the whole world is really, so we've got to stick with it.